Hey guys, welcome to another one synth challenge where I'm gonna try to make a whole song using only one synthesizer for kicks, hi-hats, snares, basses, leads, everything. In this one we've got the Korg MS-20 which is a classic vintage mono synth from Korg. Two oscillators, two filters, super kind of angry filter. So all I'm gonna do is just make a bunch of patches, layer some tracks, and then I'll post the full song at the end, so stay tuned for that. Well, right, let's start off by making a small drum kit using this synth here. So I'm gonna start making a kick drum, and again, a kick drum is made using the self-oscillating filter on a synth like this. Make sure the envelope contribution is up. And then all you wanna do is create kind of a plucky shape here. So we got this nice slappy kick, which is perfect because I'm trying to do sort of a trappy rap song here. And the cool thing about the MS-20 is that it's got this little patch panel here. So for example, if I wanted to have more of a melodic control over this filter, I can just patch the keyboard output here to the cutoff frequency of whatever filter I'm using. So the high pass in this case. All right, next let's make a little hi-hat using the noise oscillator here, which is in oscillator one. And we can use the filter to sculpt it a little bit too. So I'm just gonna sample a few of these flavors of hi-hats. All right, so now we got a snare drum, similar thing. I just added a bit of oscillator to simulate the membrane of the drum here. All right, so I've created a little drum kit using only the MS-20. So here are the sounds we have. We have a kick. Hi-hat, second hi-hat, snare, second snare, third snare, kind of a more muted kick, and then this little fatter kick. All right, so I've created this preliminary drum loop here, and I'm just looped it through the entire track. And I've massaged a few of these drum sounds in Impulse. So Impulse gives you some controls like adding drive and pitching the sounds up and down. All right, so I'm gonna leave the drums for there. So let's move on and create a little bass line. All right, so I got a super simple bass patch here. Just a lot of envelope contribution to the cutoff frequency, cut off all the way down, a little bit of resonance, and then sustain down, a bit of decay and release to create more of like a pucky, pucky? Plucky <laughs> bass sound. All right, let's lay down a bass line. All right, so I made this cool organic patch just to fill up the middle of the frequency range, and here's what it sounds like. And I've got a little bit of Valhalla reverb going on in the plugin here. So it's a super simple patch. I have two oscillators. One is kind of a thin square wave, and that's the main pitch. And the other one is adding a little bit of noise just to dirty up the sound. All right, so I'm just gonna lay down some tracks and kind of add chords to fill up the sound. So in that case, I've played all the thirds of the chords, so I'm just gonna duplicate this track and track it again and add the fifths. All right, so I'm gonna use the same basis as before, except I'm gonna remove the high pass filter here. I've pitched this up and I'm using a sawtooth this time and a quick attack so that I can play more melodic stuff. And since I want to add vibrato to the mod wheel here, I'm going to use the patch panel. So I'm going to use the mod wheel control to open up the VCA here. And as the input to the VCA, I'm going to feed the LFO. And then as the output of that, I'm going to feed that to control the sort of master frequency. And so now I can bring vibrato with the mod wheel. Very subtle, but it'll help me add a bit of expression as I'm playing this melody here. All right, so I've created this flute sound to play as my lead melody here. All right, so I've created this weird sound effect thing by adding a lot of square wave LFO to the two filters.
So I'm just gonna record that in the chorus here and I'm gonna keep it super in the background later. All right, so I'm gonna record a little rap over this. I'm rolling down the street in my Corolla. Slower than a mother with a stroller. I ride the bus without a destination. Just so I can see the final station. All right, let's lay down some random ad libs. My Corolla. Toyota. Slower than a mother with a stroller. Baby. Head into the. I'm gonna duplicate the last lines here where. What? Cause I'm sick of riding this merry go round. All right, I'm gonna record this little plucky. All right, so I've cracked the resonance to the point where it's almost on the verge of crackling. And just to add a bit of character, I'm gonna double up that line now with that. Brown. All right, so now we have this intro here. All right, so I'm gonna wrap it up there. I'm probably gonna add a little bit of EQ and do some touch-ups, and then I'm gonna play the whole song at the end of the video. So thanks so much for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Why do we keep on living? Round and round and round.